Thank you for watching all of my previous uh, pointillism pictures. And so we only have three more pointillism pictures left before the next award. The next award will begin after when I am done the 30th pointillism picture of the video. So now, ooh, let's, uh, uh, let's focus on what's today's pointillism picture. Today's 27 pointillism picture is a furnace. A furnace is similar to a fireplace that will make your house uh, warm from the cold. It will help you to feel better so no one can get some chills. But you can also have a smooth break when you're going to the furnace. But don't go near to it or else you might even burn. Or, and don't open this as well or else you might burn your body. So let's get coloring. For this furnace, uh, I would like this type of variation. I will, let's say, I'll choose uh, iron and stainless furnace. So, we'll, we'll take our markers and I'm gonna choose gray. Let's do the part of, uh, of its furnace and then we'll do the sides and the door to cover for the fire. That's gonna be light gray. We're almost done. For the next one, I'll use light gray. Er, I think this one is a bit kind of gray though. We'll do the head part the middle part and then the door that's called a cage that's for the part of its furnace
this might take a while so i will make this video a bit faster and once it's done i will stop this uh, fast motion And now, let's continue coloring with, uh, with black. It might be almost running out of ink, but it's gonna take a little while. So I'll just smoothly shade. Okay, this pointillism picture uh, is not quite done yet. So we have to color the fire at the bit of orange or yellow. So I'm gonna take the colors are mango and then sun yellow and then orange. Let me get the colors. That one. Mango, sun yellow, orange. Let's start coloring.
thank you for watching this pointless um, video about this episode. Make sure you subscribe. And I'm so excited because uh, the Pointillism Award is coming when I finish uh, two more Pointillism pictures. And don't forget, a spring will be here tomorrow. So, I'll see you again. Goodbye.